Hello. All right, hello there indeed, everybody. Welcome to Monday Night Stream. So I hope everybody had a great Monday. Hopefully you have survived it like the rest of us have. And we, it's like we got all of our promotional stuff done and out of the way. So we're going to go ahead and jump right on into the game. Here we go. We got our wonderful disco mix going on up in here. So we're doing the single player now. They actually offer a single player version in this game now, which is pretty cool and interesting at the same time. So we're gonna go ahead and just jump in here and get stuff we need. That one there, that one, I don't need that. Give me the lighters. Motion sensor, an extra that one there. Give me all that, all that, all that. One of those, one of those. Three of those, that should be good. I think, maybe. Marble. Start off with Tanglewood. Here we go. Oh, I'm gonna get fast load, ooh. Decently fast load. ...and prepare accordingly before starting the investigation. I've also written some notes on the whiteboard if you need them. No report this time. Be careful. You're going uh, in blind. Wrong little button there. There we go. Phasma. There we go. There we got my Phasma stuff ready to go. We got Nalun Susan Martinez. Get that up in here. You get the name up for everybody here, Susan Martinez. And give me one of these, one of those. And one of these. Alrighty. Not really going to hit too much here. I saw an alert pop up on my phone, but I did not see it pop up on stream here as we want to sure we get all that going there you okay you okay let's well, we'll run your toes over and Nope, I guess, guess not. I thought I'd seen an alert, but it didn't work, but nope, guess it didn't. That's okay. Thought I'd go ahead and check that. If somebody did do it, I want to make sure they get their time in the spotlight. Alrighty, Susan, give me a sign of where you're at. One little EMF in my hand. Just need these lights to light up on me here. Move something. Chunk something. But I know where you're at, Susan. Susan Martinez. Open up. There we go. Make sure I got nice, easy doors here. Susan Martinez, come on. The thing here says you like people to be alone. Well, there's nothing but alone here tonight. Just me, myself, and I, and people in my chat. Susan. 
Give me a sign. Found your bone. Susan Martinez. A lot of you ghost recently have been really stingy on your evidences. Come on, Susan. Give me a sign. Where are you? Gotta be around here somewhere. Where are you? Look at the thermometer here. Um, book we can just chunk. Thermometer. Yeah, it's been a low sanity drain so far. Right, let's see if we get any temp very at home. Sixteen and sixteen. Charentine. I had a 9.8 here, 11, 9.9. Yep, uh, I say we found the room. I got this book here. Go ahead and write in it for me. As I save the kitty. So I'm gonna add that command in there. It's gonna be some more kitty command. There we go. Kitty's been saved. We gotta go smudge, salt it, and photo it. Salt, so we got the camera up in there. The good old two birds, one stone. I got tacos it up right there. Puffy, I'm puffy because we had too many tacos. So, bathroom is where it's at, and we do have orbs. So, we gotta bring. Uh. You in and you in. And a little bit of activity is going on there with the EMF. Not a whole lot. Are you here? Where are you? Are you here? How old are you? There's a 
book reader right in. Oh. EMF three. Oh, I saw you stomping that one. You stomped in that. Full on stomped inside that salt. Yeah, piece of paper under my chair there. Hey, like, full on, like, kablam! Oh, yeah. oh, I got that. I was gonna do fingies. The wrong one of these. I want that one. Yeah, you take the picture of the fingies. And I still want a picture of the ghost. Bump our sanity up so we don't get a issue with him. Well, her actually, it's her, sorry. Susan Martinez, can you show yourself? Susan Martinez, can you show yourself? Susan Martinez. Susan Martinez. Come on out, Susan. Susan, show yourself. Yeah, while you're waiting to do that, I'm gonna go get a picture of your bone, okay? Okay, Susan, I'm back. Susan, show yourself. Come on out, Susan. Yep, I hear you. You're on your open up doors. That's nice of you. I need you to come out here so I can take a picture of you. Okay, Susan Martinez. Don't make me go out there and, sm and get the smudge stick and smudge you. Okay, I'm dropping the camera down. I'm gonna go get the smudge. We gotta figure out what the last piece of evidence is. Find out what we're looking for here. Okay, so we got here, we got here, we got orbs, and we have fingies. We got a banshee or a hantu. So a banshee, we're looking for dots. Hantu, we're looking for freezing. Dots, I have them in there right now. But I want, want to move the camera in closer a little bit and get another dots thing going on. And we'll put one of these down here too.
just in case. I think that was the dots right there. Let's go double check that one. I'm pretty sure that was dots. Which means we got ourselves a banshee. Yeah, we got another orb going up right there and there. Pretty sure. Yep, dots. We got us a banshee. We got three star bone and three star fingies. Okay, let's go in there and smudge her real quick. Mud should be done. Yep, there's just a photo of the ghost is all that's left. Now the question is how badly do we want this picture? Okay, Susan, you're coming out here on the hole. Thank you. Oh, what was that? Oh, only a two-star picture of the ghost. Oh, well, still a picture of the ghost. Objective's done. Figured out what it was. Adios, amiga. Here we go. bibbidi babbidi boo that's how we do. Okay, that was good. All right, another dots in there. Two more video cameras. Handle all the crucifixes. All the lighters. Motion sensor. Extra photo camera. All the salt, all the sandy, all the smudge. Strong, thermo, and three tripods. Let's do a farmhouse now here. Here we go. Everybody joining in, welcome, welcome. Thank you for dropping on in. Doing some, as you can see, phasmophobia here tonight. Right. Check the equipment and get set up before yeah. investigating. Carol Williams and, and remember everyone. To check the whiteboard for help. I can type. I promise I can type. What do we got over here? Ah, uh, people are talking about the crazy bottages going on. Yeah, I got hit by that one yesterday. That was not a nice one, but it was all okay. We had a nice bot up in here. Take care of it all. 
Okay, we'll grab this one, and we'll grab this one. Here we go. <laughs> this stamina thing is always fun now. Oh, it's bone right off the bat. Okay, Carol. Can you give us a sign? You got your bone right here. Give us a sign for where you are. We just want to get to know you a little bit. Find out where you are. Find out what you are. That's all we're wanting. I got this little device in my hand here. All this will do is light up when you're nearby. So give me some of them lights. Yep. One light, two lights, five lights. It's all good. Want some lights. Come on out, Carol. Give me a sign where you are. Yep. Move something, turn on a light. Give me dirty water in a sink. Show yourself even, that'd be fine too. Just give me a sign. Carol. Gotta make these little lights in my hand just go up. Let them up. Are you here in this bathroom? This door was opened by me. Carol, give me a sign. Are you in here, Carol? so far. Gold has been the hallway so far. down to 12. I need to back up to 16, but I think a wild guess. I'd say that's your room. I would say that will be it. A sanity killer too. Okay, let's go.
Hey, Joel, how you doing? Welcome, welcome to the stream, sir. Just cold up in here. Yeah, I still think it's you. I still think so. It's been a month for me. It has definitely been a month. But the month is almost over. Hopefully it ends on a positive note for people. I would definitely like it if it does. Alright, nothing orbit wise there. Hope I got the right room there. Yeah, let's go and just check out is this bearded box? Are you here? Where are you? Are you here? How old are you? Hey, thingies, we got that for sure. We actually didn't check up here in the attic. Oh. Of course, that's where it would be. Are you here? How old are you? Where are you? It's still not that. Not 
that there. Write in my book, please. Right in that dash darn book. Right, let's run out here to the camera and see if we got anything on there for like orbs or something. course not. Thank you. There's my motion sensor. So put this in, looking the other way. The attic is a huge area to try to cover. Got one camera going that way. We got to get another one going this way. the motion sensor? Gosh. Oh, don't be doing that to me. Hi there. Yep, this is the room. going to the other side. So are you. Right in the book while you're, while you're over there. A lot of family drama going on. I, I hear that. I understand that. Drop of three. Yeah, let's still say no orbs. Do another one of these. Get the dots up in there. See, we didn't have a camera up there last time with us, so we could actually take a picture of her. Um, I'm. She might. I don't know what's going on with her in the gaming stuff right now. With the the move and all that. Should be good. I 
Can you write in the book, please? Stop wandering from room to room. And come out. Yeah, that's what Mama said she was gonna be doing. It's the doing the birthday stream there. So, yeah, I'm not sure what her gaming schedule and everything like that is. Oh, yeah, I jumped before. Yeah, that might be an EMF 5 right there. Question is, do we have dots? It surprised everyone, Joel, but that's, you know. People do, you know, those things that they want to do that they feel be best for their lives. And that's one of the things that she thought would be best for hers. So more power to her. And not seeing... Anything on the dots. From a nine to a six, and a six to a one. We had the jump before, but we didn't have a drop of four. Are you here? Where are you? How old are you? Where are you? Are you here? Cold temps up here. The dots, I'm just not seeing the dots. Because dots are definitely not the easiest of things to see. Come on, you can run through the dots anytime now.
we got the motion sensor. Candles up there. We're only getting jump early jumps of three on the EMF. I'm not seeing dots happening per se. I got another one of these I can do. I can have this go from the opposite direction looking in towards them. That makes why This thing is being the most annoying ghost. Opening up that door, then going like in every other room, not giving consistent, you know, I'm here evidences. I checked for orbs and there was, I was getting the cold temps up there, but no orbs, nothing on dots. She appeared to me up there. I got a big old handprint on the bathroom door at the end of that hall up there, just underneath the attic. Cause she opened that door at like beginning of the game here. I started getting cold temperatures in there. And I got to cold temperatures in that other, uh, up in the attic. It was consistently cold up there in the attic too, for a while. Um, dots were new for the new, the, not the newest update, but like the couple updates ago. Where it's like, I might actually not help. I'm not doing that. Doesn't show up in dots when you're doing infrared. Haha. -ha. The night vision doesn't work. But you see like a ghostly figure go by the green lights there. There's like um, an outline almost of the ghost. But it doesn't work if you have infrared turned on. You know, the night vision.
Night vision works great for the orbs, but not for the dots. So like from where this camera's at, just off over here to the left is where she was when she appeared to me as just a shadow figure. Which I know that can happen anywhere in the house, not necessarily just in their room, but that combined with the uh, cold temperatures. Yeah, so she blew it, and then the candle did too. She blew out the candle. All right, let's go get some picture evidence of things. See, but then, like, that light's turned on now. Pictures of the voodoo dolls. Don't mind the emo. Nope, I don't mind the emotes at all. Okay, but now this light's on in here. Like bringing in one camera and one dots to here. Yeah, that's how like that was the, the original room I found. Evidence that, like, right there on the door is the fingerprints. <laughs> you had a mama moment. That's okay. Yeah, 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 you're ringing the bell. No one's answering that phone. I'm not falling for your tricks. This is being very active on the floor, not with the freaking attic. You see, like, interaction, interaction, interaction. Fingerprints right there on the door. So now we got down to friggin', you know, eight different ghosts. And I would say we've eliminated orbs. And spirit box. That demon, myling, gin, or goyro.
They added a bunch more ghosts. Yeah, they actually, they got, let's see here. One, two, three. Actually, about four, yeah. The Goiro, the Hantu, the Yokai, and the Myling. And here we're getting an 18, 15, 18. If we went into the hallway, we're getting a 17. Laundry room is like a 19, 15. So like we're not really getting cold. This room, same thing. We're saying fairly warm. Don't know what I'm gonna do for Halloween yet. Other than taking kiddos out trick or treating, don't know what we're doing for Halloween yet. Eighteen point two in here. Consistently cold place I've been getting was up here, but then that was jumping up too. Oh, we got we got freezing now. Okay, we got at least that. We got freezing. We got gin and demon. Gin we look for EMF five. Demon we look for writing, I believe. Yeah, writing. Yeah, I got this book right here. If you can write in it, that'd be great. And I'm thinking we actually are probably gonna have the EMF five. We did have that spike of four down there. Okay, I know you're up here. Can you show yourself and write in my book? Carol Williams. Carol Williams, can you show yourself? Write in my book. Can you write in the book? Write in my book, please. The whole scary month thing. And talk to him in general. It's probably gonna be a lot more of like uh, Haunt Chaser, this, uh, Ghost Hunter Core, you know. And then doing uh, like FNAF VR help wanted on the side and among a few other things jump before drop before yep I would definitely say we have an EMF 5 on that one but as if I guess you confirm that one I want to go ahead and say the gin And we got all of our objectives done. Go full VR or non VR mode? Um, it'll be, well, for the help wanted VR, it'll be VR, and it'll be just recordings for the channel, not for uh, live stream. Because uh, my headset and this do not play nicely together. Just saying. You 
You know, if I can get my VR headset to work nicely with this, then I would do some VR streams, but... Yeah, for some reason, you know, the Quest, it doesn't really like it on here too much. Oh yeah, so put that down here because you appeared here. Okay, Carol, can you give me a sign here just one more time? Just need to see if you actually are giving me an EMF-5 or if that was a fluke. So you need to make these lights light up or you need to write in this book. Come on, Carol Williams. Let's do this. Let's go. Write in the book or make these lights jump up in my hand. As for people who like me who don't VR, that option is nice. With the non-VR option, is uh, FNAF VR. Um, it's all single player, just like regular FNAF is uh, single player. Carol Williams. Come on, Carol. Give me a sign, lady. Carol Williams, Carol Williams. Carol, you're not being very nice. You're showing up over here. You're giving me EMF fours. I just need to confirm there's an EMF five. Come on, Carol. Carol. You are being weird. Come on, Carol. Thank you for the confirmation on the EMF-5. We are now out of your hair. Oh, my mother's gonna take this with me. Do do do. Solve the mystery, it's a gin. And we're just taking a beer. Alright, all objects is done. It is locked in. Bibbly bobbly boo, that's how we do. Oh yeah. Look at that. Nice blurry pictures of ghosts going on. All right, adding in see, one dot, a couple of these, one of those, all of those. We need the lighters. Two motion sensors because that actually would help out doing a couple of those. Extra one of those. All the salt, all the sanding, all the smudge. Alright, tangle wood. And let's do. Interesting little print right there. Take a look at the equipment and prepare accordingly before starting the investigation. I've also written some notes on the 
Point Linda Williams. No report this time. Be careful. You're going in blind. Going in blind? You're not like going in blind. All right, here we go. So we got to do motion sensor. <laughs> We're not escaping during a hunt. And salt. Yeah, let's do it this way. Come on. There we go. <laughs> Nina Williams. Nope, Linda Williams. This is Carol's sister, apparently. Linda Williams. Give us a sign. Tell us what room it is you're hiding behind. If you really want me to stop Linda, you'll show us what room. I'm sure chat would be saying this guy cannot sing a tune. Linda Williams. I already found the bone. Nina Williams is a character from Tekken. Well, but you never know. We might come across a, uh, a Nina Williams at some point in the game here. Yeah, okay, found your bone right there, Linda. You can keep your creepy mannequin to yourself, though. Linda Williams. Linda Where are you Linda? I have not found your Luigi board You must be hiding it somewhere Are you here? How old are you? Where are you? Are you here? Are you friendly? How old are you? Are you here? Are you friendly? How old are you? Are you friendly? Are you here? You are here. Are you friendly? So EMF three in the basement. No spirit box. Saving the kitty. Because you know, you gotta do that. and the book all right here we go hey, there's a book for you to doodle on Feel free to doodle away. Doodle doodle do. Do the doodle. In the book. Maybe we don't ask very much of these ghosts in these games, do we? You know, just show yourself. Draw in the book. Um, yeah, we'll go ahead and do. 
checking for orbage. They made these cameras a lot darker now. So you have to actually like shine your flashlight on the screen to really be able to see anything. Okay, so I would say no orbage going on. We're not seeing major sanity drops. And we'll go ahead and do this. Drop that to the bottom of the stairs. Have some fun with it. Get some dots. Get some dotage going on. Still not seeing any orbage. There is one of these ghosts though that when you put these things down, you can't see it except for in the camera. So. There we go. Dottage is down. Still no writing in the book. We don't have anything on the spirit box. Jumpiness that this thing's doing. We did have a jump before and a drop before. Come on. Show me some dotage. That was the fun part. I do this thing on just in case. Because all it is, it's like a silhouette, you know, little piece of the ghost. It's all you really see. And just watch when I looked away right there, that's when I came by. Motion sensor. Sandy, we're doing okay on. Give me some salt. We'll throw some of that down there too. Okay, that was nice of you. Knocking stuff off over here. Wish that would show fingerprints on it.
Yeah, I'm hearing you walk around over there. Are you here? Are you friendly? Spooky skeleton ghosts. Wow, my bird is making funny noises over here. There's one piece and there's like jiggling and rattling the whole flipping thing. That's kind of cool. Good. Now if we can actually get some evidence here. Evidence would be freaking fantastic. Really, Mr. Ghost? Mrs. Ghost, I should say, because it's Linda. Definitely hit with the temperatures. See, I have that book one right there. Just go ahead and pick up the pen and write in the book. All right, we got fingies finally. Come in here. Maybe she's shy. She definitely is shy. She's hot in my ear once and not given a single shred of evidence other than now touching a door. And she's touched a door. That is like it. I would say we can rule out dots because she's been walking right in front of and around that dots area. I say we might have an EMF five, but definitely not a spirit box. I say no orbs. I mean, either freezing, writing. Or the EMF Sell some writing. Sell some scribblish writing. We're looking for an either. Ah, oh, that did not count, did it? Interaction only. Dang it.
That EMF was not going off. Only down to three on the temps. Okay, Linda, can you do it again? Can you show yourself again? Linda, that's kind of cool. You showed yourself there. Can you, can you do it again? Come on, Linda. Linda, show yourself. Okay, I'm gonna get across. Gonna get the crucifix on you. She's a little too shy, is what I have to say about this one. Yeah, I think my EMFs are possibly busted. That's my option. I pretty much have freezing temps or EMF five. And the miling. That's when it's supposed to be one of more frequently makes paranormal sounds. Should have made a sound like twice. But then it's not getting freezing either. And I do believe I had that spike and drop of four. That would be an EMF five confirmed by the board. Hey, Linda. Linda Williams. Give me a sign. Linda, give me a sign that you're here. Hey Linda, I see you're making it cold. But can you make it freezing? Or you can make those lights on this little box here shoot up. They're all lit up. Light up all my lights, Linda. Linda Williams. Linda Williams, give me a sign. Oh, there's a three. Okay, can you make it more than that? I got a three. Can you give me two more lights, Linda? Linda Williams, come on. Three lights just isn't going to do it for me. I need five. Five lights or freezing temperatures. That's what I need, Linda. Can you make it, can you make it freezing in here? 
you know, sub zero temperatures. We got down to, you know, three, five. We go lower than that, Linda. Linda. I need my final piece of evidence. I'm going to get out of your hair. Need one last piece of evidence. Either an EMF 5 or freezing temperatures, please. EMF 5. Thank you. Can I get a picture real quick? Can you show yourself? Linda Williams gave me the EMF 5. Can you show yourself? Coming out for a picture, Linda Williams. Linda, come on out. Let me see you. Come out for a picture. Right now. No, okay, fine. That's fine. We'll take your EMF 5 and go. Picture would have been bonus money because, you know, I'm not going to get the uh, uh, escape during a hunt thing because, you know. Yeah, no. I am not good, like, flimsy when it comes to dodging around stuff. There we go. Three pieces of evidence and a miling. Board's good for what we're going to get with it. Kitty has been saved. Baby, the baba the blue, that's how we do. Go ahead and do another here. Got some dots, got the cameras. Do, 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 do. All right, let's go ahead and do. Let's do Ridge View. That'd be a good one. A good fun one to do. Yeah, I didn't see my breath at all on that one because it wasn't freezing. So some of the temperatures do take a little while for them to come out, though. Sometimes you'll be in a map for, you know, 10, 15 minutes, and then all of a sudden, boom, here you go. Here's your freezing temps. You know, it's not like before where it's like you would be in there for like five minutes and be like, oh, okay, here's temperature. There's the room. Boom. Okay, we got freezing temps. There we go. We got our piece of evidence. They don't do it that way anymore, which is good because it makes it a little bit better uh, longevity game. We've arrived. Check the equipment and get set up before investigating. Karen Clark. Remember to check the whiteboard for help. New intel. Reports of light switching. Possibly harmless, but be careful out there. <laughs> Possibly harmless. Possibly. Otherwise known as most likely going to kill you. That there, that there, that there. And there we go. As we now enter Mama's Death House. After this map shall forever be known as. Okay, Karen. Take me to your manager. I want to be taken to your manager. Because you're not being ghostly enough. I mean, there have been a few complaints about you. They say all you're doing is flipping some light switches. And you're not actually being the spooky scary ghost you're supposed to be 
So, Karen Clark, it is time for you to give up your ghost card. Because you're just not spooky enough. Because Karen, if you want to be spooky, you gotta actually do something. See this little box in my hand? You gotta make the lights jump up. If you do that, then you might be getting a little bit more spooky credibility. But not much. Because you Excuse me, are not spooky enough. Not by a long shot. Hmm, trying to do the opening door thing. The clicking of the handles. That might work for some spooky points. Maybe, Karen Clark. Oh, uh, you're doing that might also uh, give away your position, though. Uh, yeah, well, we do kind of need to know where you are, Karen, so we can give you your, your uh, ghost evaluation here tonight. Ghost evaluation is pending. And so far, you're not passing, Karen Clark. Not at all, Karen. Are you here? Where are you? Are you friendly? How old are you? Are you here? How old are you? Are you friendly? I think it's probably gonna be the uh, the laundry room. Hi, Cloud Delta. How you doing? Welcome, welcome to the stream. Hello uh, there. I have to go that screen and my stream deck. I have one right there. Three. I can get on the thing. I can get on the. There we go. Wrong button. I'm doing pretty good. Having. Pretty good time hunting these ghosts here tonight, having some fun doing it. What else I have my hands here? Oh, I have that still. Well, that was a no. So far, at least. So I'm having a good, fun time here. Of course, that's the best part about what we do, having fun doing it. We're gonna go ahead and drop that there. Drop that there. Drop that there. Head on out. See if we got ourselves from our spooky ghosty orbs. Ooh. Apologies there. I'm trying not to yawn too much here on the stream, but it's been a long day. Okay. Not seeing any orbs. So we're going to go ahead and get another camera. And we'll get it. This one of a thing so we can check for the fingerprints. We'll put this actually looking down that hallway just in case it's a hallway ghost. Okay, 
Yeah, it seems to me Monday always seems to be that long day, though. Yeah, this day just seems to be extra long. And that's a no on Orbage. Got a couple of these. And we're on the safe side. Try not to go insane yet. Stop huffing and puffing like you've had too many tacos. And we got some dirty water going on there. Need to get my regular camera up in here. Didn't find the bone, but we can at least get dirty water. Kind of bummed I didn't see the bone at all in the house there. That's double money I won't be getting. I got ghost event and detected with the, with the EMF. We do got to stop a hunt with a crucifix, but. Are we going to get some dotage here? Come on. Give me that silhouette running through on the dots. Nope. Don't think we're going to get dotage on this one. Throw the crucifix down right there in front of that door. Right there. Mr. Spirit. Madam Karen. Go ahead and write in this book, please. Yeah, the book it is dying for your autograph. Now you're doing a good job of trying to be a spooky, scary ghost here, Karen. But you gotta work a little bit harder and actually like, give a little bit of evidence here so we can know what it is you are. And you knock that cup down. You're doing a good job with that one. Okay, let's pop this down over here. Um, don't think I have, no, don't have a thermometer on me yet. Let's go get some temperature readings. Ooh, ooh, ooh. That's an orb in the garage. Orbage in the garage. Yep.
Hey, let me okay. bring the book to you. Really, you're gonna, you're gonna go and play the piano for me out here. Go look for some. We got some orbage. Let's go see if we got some dotage. Ooh, especially since it's in the garage, and now we know that. Let's see, but it moved the laundry room door, and it went and gave me my EMF reading right there. This is not very nice of you, Mrs. Ghost. Give me a wrong. Evidence is like that. Not nice at all. Question is, are you going to be nice and give me dot evidence here if you have dot evidence? Yep, that was dot evidence. Those of you who missed it, it was like that real quick little, it went right there by the garage door. It was like right here. You keep watching in there, it might happen again. It's real fast, and it's just a faint silhouette, like a little shadow of a thing going through there, a little quick white blur that flies through. It might do it again. If you blink, you might miss it, though. That's the fun part about the dots. Okay, we're going on. So, in our evidence is here, we know we have orbs and we have dots. We have, you need eagle vision. You really do for that one. It is very hard to see. Like, it's, it's literally like you blink, you miss it. We have Banshee, Yuri, and Yakai. Banshee would be Fingy Prince, I believe. Yes. Yakai would be Spirit Box. And it would be Yuri, which would be freezing. So we need spirit box, fingies, or freezing. We need to take the spirit box in there with us. We are so bad. Um, yeah, we'll take the camera in there with us just in case. I could have swore I had one of these in that are with me. With me already. I did already hit it. Are you here? Are you friendly? Where are you? Are you here? Are you friendly? That was a no. We're going to get freezing temps all over us for a minute here because power was off. I'm gonna slowly warm up though for the rest of the house. So we're getting 3.8 and 4. Okay, so head back out here real quick. Okay, so spirit box was out. Fingies is the other one. And that would be this. And there's our fingies. There. And there. We 
Because we got ourselves a banshee. I'm going to do that. Banshee! Now, do I really want to go and try to make this thing prevent a hunt? Got one crucifix just inside the door by a little more than six feet. Put this one. There. You. There. So you're no one six feet apart. You're right there by the door. Technically, banshees can hunt whenever they want. But I believe they are still bound a little bit by sanity levels. So, we'll go ahead and we'll sit in a dark cabinet here just for a little bit. And work on lowering that sanity down. Just because it's fun that way, you know what I mean? Because the more you can lower the sanity, or the faster you can do it, the faster that they might be able to actually hunt you. I think I was up at like 80% when I went in the house here, so might be a minute. There's a tiny minute. But being in dark cabinets helps your sanity drop yep not hunting yet you can tell that right there from that That's all you gotta do. Want another hunting? Push that. If you don't get any uh, static, then you know. Huh. Alright, what's the sandy level at? You know what our sanity level is. Are we going insane yet? Probably not. Uh, not bad, 68. Let's go ahead and we'll head upstairs into a closet. So, same thing. Any, you know, Include a space like this with uh, no flashlight on. Makes your sanity drop. And we'll do intermittent hunting checks. Although, up here we should be able to hear when that front door closes. Should be able to know exactly when. Dirty water. Hey, Karen's not happy. And Karen gets mad. That's when the dirty water comes out. Ooh. 
Come on, Karen. Try to hunt. You can do it, Karen. Hope I got those crucifixes in the right spot. It's kind of the key, you know what I mean? Put those crucifixes in the right spot, and then that should stop her. Give it another minute or two here. This is prime streaming content right here. Totally awesome. Prime grade A stream content. Maybe. Check the board. For A, sanity, and B, did she try? Right, we are now in huntable territory, but she has not tried to hunt yet. Come on, Karen. Try to hunt. Try and hunt, Karen. We're so scared. Karen might get us. We're scared of the Karen. Karen might try to hunt us and take us to her manager. Or demand that we take her to ours. But we're hiding down in the basement. In case Karen wants to have us take her to our manager. Nothing. Oh, now she's trying that. Already, either our crucifix has failed or one worked and then she was able to go through. Yep, one worked and then she was able to go through. Nice. Alrighty. We did it. We got it. We made it. Banshee. Everything completed. Bibbidi bobbidi boo, that's how we do. Oh, yeah.
Good old Banshee. Alrighty. We made some good stuff right there. We made some good progress. Had some good fun. We got some nice little B-Bobby music going on here. So I just want to thank everybody for dropping by in the stream tonight. We're not going to have enough time to get one more game in here, so we're just going to just yeah, go ahead and end it right here. But thank you, everybody, who swung on in. Joel, thank you for hanging out and chatting out with me tonight. Cloud Delta, thank you for stopping on by. It was awesome seeing you here and everybody who is hanging out in the background lurking and just enjoying the streams. Thank you for being here as well. So if you haven't done it already, go ahead. Do me a favor right down below there there is that follow button for everybody here on twitch go ahead and hit that button for me and you'll get a notification when you make those notifications stay on the next time i go live which will be on friday october 1st most likely doing more of the scary spooky horror type games because it is halloween coming up and stay tuned over on my youtube channel You'll be able to see some more Halloween style games over there, starting with from FNAF VR. You'll be finding clips and everything of the horror games we're doing over here on Twitch. And I look forward to seeing all of you both places. In the meantime, you guys have a great week. I will see you on Friday. Spread the word, tell your friends, get them all up in here. See you then. Adios.